What's good guys, I'm John the Chief, and for today's video it's going to be a super easy medkit farming spot. Uh, you can get a shit ton of medkits here, and you guys, if you start getting farther in the game, start getting to Old Town, you'll realize that medkits are extremely valuable, because you, you're going to want a ton of them, because one hit from boomers and everything, just... You're going to need to heal yourself up. So, for the location to go to is this safe house right here. If you do not have it unlocked, you got to do a couple of quests for Alfie. And this safe house will be one of the places that you stop by. I, when you're up here, you take a zip line to the other side of the bridge. This is the only way to get to this side of the bridge because you need a zip line to get here. After you do that, you're going to walk right through the center, and there's going to be medkits literally everywhere. This is like a healing spot that before like it got overrun with infected. So there are a ton of medkits and gauze. If you're running low on gauze or medkits, this is where you want to be. Now you can see those stacks of medkits on uh, behind me. I didn't pick that up first, but... um. There are a ton of medkits in here. It's crazy. Like, all right, so you got to pick up that. That's worth, like, three medkits. Uh, I already passed one, but it doesn't matter because you can do this farming run so often. Uh, it, it's extremely fast. I've gone over 100 in, like, less than 30 minutes, so it's it's, it's a really fast spot. Because uh, each one of those big packages that I pick up is worth about three medkits. And I've been just looting the place over and over again. I, so you don't need to actually kill these zombies. I was still learning the route at this time. But you just go forward. That's not the end. You get to the very back and there will be two more giant stacks of medkits that are each worth three again. So that's a total of 15 just from the stacks of medkits that you get per run. So that is extremely useful. And the, you don't need to save and quit. All you have to do is kill yourself. It does cost a little bit of survivor rank. But I will show you guys a really fast spot to get Survivor Rank. I figure out a good farming strategy for Survivor Rank and Power uh, Power, so you can level up those two extremely fast. Uh, I'll post the videos as soon as I can. But uh, that's basically it. So after you finish and pick them all up, you just let yourself die. So I'm going to let this zombie grab me and just eat me. And then you will spawn at the very top of that safe house where we originally were. And you can just keep repeating the run because all the loot is farmable. You can just keep going back because as soon as you die, all the loot resets. So I, I found this spot to be extremely helpful. Uh, big shout out to my friends Zylo, Blurred Cusher, and Krillin's TV. Uh, they all Those three showed me this spot, so I thought it was amazing. So uh, yeah, shout out to them. But, uh, yeah, it's a it's an amazing spot for farming medkits. I actually found it really useful because I end up having to pop one, like, every single minute in the uh, late game when you're starting getting to the old town because there are a ton of enemies there. You get hit by goons, demolishers, and you're just going to need to heal yourself up constantly. So uh, it's a lot better than that because you can, like, there's other ways of farming medkits, but this is by far the fastest way. Hope you guys enjoy the video, and have a great day, guys.